Hey guys, it's Jessamine Stanley, and you're watching Healthy Her on Madame Noir. Body positivity is really misunderstood in the mainstream. A lot of people think that body positivity is like pretty much just fat girls want to feel good about themselves and so let's make clothes for fat girls or something like that. Body positivity to me is really just the idea that you're okay today exactly as you are. You don't need to do anything. You don't need to change anything. Everything about you is perfect. In my mind, body positivity is actually the step toward a healthier society. What we don't recognize is that diet culture perpetuates ideas that do not make people want to be healthy. It makes people very unhappy and it sets a lot of unhealthy eating cycles into, what, into uh, being. And so, if instead you start from a place of respecting your body, respecting every curve, every crack, every scar, everything that you've been told to be ashamed of, you start from a place of respecting it. And then when you respect your body, when you love your body, when you value your body, that's when you wanna take care of your body. I would absolutely say that body positivity was born on the backs of black women. So much work within the self that black women are required to do because of the way that our society has treated us. And we have been in a constant state of reclamation of our bodies, these bodies that have been sexualized and fetishized and exoticized. And we've been taught to not love ourselves because our bodies are seen as offensive to other people. And so for the black woman, body positivity is of the utmost necessity, not just to feel good about herself, but so that she can take care of a community. The Underbelly app is for everyone and anyone who has ever said, I can't do yoga. Traveling around the world, teaching in this body and teaching lots of different people, I recognize that while there are like other yoga apps and there's other yoga classes, no one is really giving the experience where we're actually harvesting compassion and making a space where like, it's cool to be yourself. And I realized that somebody needs to be making a studio that's not for one specific person, it's for everybody. The underbelly is a really unique space in which instead of trying to conform to what other people think you should be, you get to embody who you truly are. So a huge part of the reason that I frequently photograph myself either naked or not wearing a lot of clothes, it's a part of my body reclamation work. We don't recognize it, but we're shaming ourselves when we say that we're not allowed to wear certain types of clothing or that our bodies have to be covered up in certain ways. And you don't really notice that shame until you take your clothing off. And I think that because we've been taught that sexualizing the body is wrong and that we're not allowed to see the body in certain ways, the need jerk reaction that a lot of people have to seeing someone who's like half naked is like oh what's wrong with them like do they have security issues why do you need to show your body like this my thing is like why doesn't everyone want to show their body like this we should all feel so comfortable with the way that our bodies are formed and I do not have a great deal of comfort with how my body is formed. And it's something that helps to kind of work through that. So, I mean, I think that if you have any difficulty looking at your body naked, you need to look at your body naked more. It doesn't mean you need to take a picture of it, but you need to stand in front of a mirror, either naked, get yourself some sexy underwear and put that on and just look at yourself and appreciate yourself because you are beautiful. You've been taught to believe that you're not because they don't have pictures of all of us in magazines, but you are beautiful exactly as you are. And the more that you can understand that and the more that you can embody that, honestly, that's the only way for anyone else to feel that way about you. Because if you don't think you're beautiful, if you don't think you're sexy, if you don't think you're perfect, how the fuck is anyone else gonna think that? <laughs>